fun. But it's not. Isn't it casual anyway? I mean, casual would imply that you just sort of throw something on a few seconds before you're about to walk out the door. Like you'd go, oh, oh, there's that old thing I wore yesterday. It's got a bit of last night's dinner on it, but oh, that's okay, I'll wear it. It's only casual. <laughs> yeah, right. There's nothing casual about it at all. I mean, the decision I make about what to wear to school today could literally affect the rest of my life. I'm serious. Last term, my friend Samantha wore this dress that she just got for Christmas. And, I mean, it was the dumbest thing she'd ever done. She didn't realise that it was a bit see-through. Like, when the sun shone through and uh, she got up at assembly to read out the netball results and the whole school just burst out laughing. I felt so sorry for her. I mean, now everyone just calls her see-through Sam. I mean, the other day, we're walking to the bus stop and this guy from another school, who we don't even know, yells out on his bike, Hey, see through Sam, show us your knickers. But I mean, on the other hand, at least people know her name now. Most people at school don't think that I've got a name at all. I'm just... See through Sam's friend. So I guess it would be kind of cool if I wore something that made people notice me. Like this top. I got it for my birthday and I absolutely love it. And I mean, I bet you no one else would be wearing it. But it's kind of clingy and what if everyone suddenly realised that I've got a big bump? I mean, why would I point that out if they haven't noticed it already? <sighs> you see my dilemma? It's, it's not like I can ask mum about these kinds of things either. She doesn't have time for this kind of thing. <sighs> she thinks I should worry. She, well, she tells me I'm ridiculous. And then she thinks that I should worry about more important things. You know, it doesn't, it doesn't matter, Lila, whether, you know, people think you're pretty. So long as they think you're clever and kind. and I shouldn't worry about whether my bum or my legs are big, so long as they work properly. I mean, I guess she's probably right. She usually is. But how come I never feel anything when the teacher in class, I mean, reads out my essays and tells everyone that they should write like me? And, but when Sam Wagner smiles at me on the bus and tells me I have a cute ponytail, it feels like I'm floating and melting at the same time. <sighs> Lila, we're leaving in one minute, with or without you. Okay, I'm coming! <sighs> Whatever. Worst comes to worst, I'll just change schools.